I'm going to drag this window to my tablet right here and use my tablet as an extended monitor for my laptop. Okay, you get the concept here using a tablet as a secondary monitor. So you can see that one, I can drag back that window back and forth into my tablet like any other extended monitor. This tablet I'm using right now is Samsung running Android, but this setup can be done with iPads as well in other computers. So jump in guys and I'm going to show it to you how you can do it also. We are going to use a software called Space Desk and you can see it on their website. You can use multiple computers, laptops, tablets, and iPads to work in a multi-display scenario. But my example right now, you can use a single tablet. First thing we need to do guys is download a software for our primary PC, the main computer which is going to be the anchor for the display. So that's what they call it as a server. So for me, it's for Windows 10, Windows 11, 64-bit. You need to choose which one is compatible with your current software or your operating system right now. So while downloading this one, it will take it around one minute or two minutes. And then once it's done, you just go ahead and open it. Then go with the installation wizard, nothing uh, complicated here. Just go ahead and go for next, next, next and install the software. Okay, after we install this one, we need to jump into the tablet or iPad or another PC that we want to extend the display. Download a software that is for the client, okay? So once you're done installing this one, you can go to your notifications area here, double click on the icon of Space Desk and you will have this one. By default, this will automatically work already. You don't need to change any settings. So we're going to jump into my tablet right now, Android. Of course, you need to go for Play Store. For iPads, then go for App Store. Okay, I'll just go ahead and type in Space Desk. Then you can see it right away. You have that multi-monitor, okay, extended screen, okay. I'll click on this, then, okay, multi-monitor display extension screen. Then I'm going to install it. Like any other apps that you're going to install, of course, you need to wait for several minutes or one minute for this one. Done, I'm going to open it. It automatically de detected the server that is within the network I'm connected. So I'm just going to click the connect and then you can see the display of my laptop. By default, guys, this is on duplicate settings. So I'll go to my desktop and right click, go for display settings. Then I'm going to change this one with extended. So I'm going to extend my display to my tablet. Of course, I'm going to apply. Then next thing I want to do is the orientation of this one is one, two. So I'm just going to drag the first monitor, my main display to the right so that when I'm going to drag a window, it will drag from right to left like that. Okay, so of course for this one to work, you need to make sure that you're connected with the same network, Wi-Fi or wired. You should be connected to the same network, all right? Now, if you want to disconnect your tablet from this display, you go for that hamburger menu, then click that one. You will see the disconnect option. Of course, you're going to disconnect that one then your tablet will be disconnected as a secondary monitor. Well, I hope you, this video has been informative for you guys. I hope you can use the tablet, extra laptop or PC as a secondary monitor for you guys. And if you like this video, like, subscribe, help me make a dream of 500,000 subscribers and see you in my next video.